Hello everyone, my name is Jeanette. I've been coming to The Way for about a year now and I want to share with you guys my testimony. I grew up in a household that was filled with religion, division, depression, and lack. So I grew up believing that that was going to be my life. So some days I'll be feeling happy and other days I'll be feeling depressed. I would always find alternatives to try to really numb that part. I would, I would smoke, I would drink, I would uh, go to guy to guy, but it would never fulfill me. I thought moving out of my house was maybe another alternative to maybe heal that part of my life. So I moved out. I moved out in 2021 of January and I got my own apartment. I finally got a relationship. I, my finances were doing pretty well, but then months after that, I everything was just falling apart. So even though I had my own place, I had my relationship, I was living with a man that was really emotionally abusive and I would always get lied to in so many different ways. And I always had my thoughts of church being a certain way, religious or things like that. But a friend of mine, a really close friend of mine had invited me to come to the way. And I came and throughout the whole entire service, I was sitting there just really just judging everything. I was not really receiving any message that day. At the end of the service, a lady had came up to me and tapped me on the shoulder and said, hey, sweetie, I think you should go up there and get prayer. And I don't know why I didn't ask questions. I just said, okay. And immediately God just touched me, not knowing that it was God, not knowing what it was, but God just touched me and I got saved that day. And immediately I felt God tell me to let go of everything, to let go of my life. But in that time, I still didn't. I was thinking about committing suicide. I got this thought, okay, I'm gonna call my um, best friend at the time. She came and we prayed together and immediately God just gave me this peace this peace that I thought I was gonna find in my boyfriend, this peace that I thought I was gonna find just doing my own thing. I was at my house and I was watching service online and Pastor Marco was talking about fasting and impartation and pretty much just going into detail about that. And I was like, you know what? This is my moment to really just let go and let God. And I remember I made that decision to do that. I moved out of my house. I let go of that relationship and let go of everything. And from then on, God has just been doing so much in me. So immediately, I just jumped into the church. I jumped into DG. I started spending time with God even more. In the mornings, I would wake up and immediately I would just spend time with Him. I started getting into Holy Warriors. Now I serve in the altar team. I'm serving also in the uh, Bridge Young Adults Ministry. I love serving there and the outreach team and also the creatives marketing team. When Pastor was talking about the fast and impartation, one thing I remember him saying was, give God the year. And I was like, okay, I take that challenge. and I'm going to go and do it. I gave God the year and God has transformed me. And I encourage every single one of you that's watching right now in 2023, give God the year.